بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم فرینڈس آئی ہوپ آل آر یو لرننگ لینگویسٹکس وتھ تھیا ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ٹاک اباؤٹ فرینزک لینگویسٹکس اینڈ بفور موونگ ٹو دی کانٹینٹس آئی ووڈ لائک ٹو گیو یو این اوور ویو آف آبجیکٹوز آف دس لیسن فرسٹ ون از ڈیفائننگ فرینزک لینگویسٹکس اینڈ اٹس ریلیشن شپ ٹو ادر ڈسپلنس اینڈ سیکنڈ از انڈرسٹینڈنگ دی ایریاز آف اسٹڈی ود ان فرینزک لینگویسٹکس سچ ایز آتھرشپ انالیسز and speaker identification and the third objective of this lecture is exploring the application of forensic linguistics in criminal investigation including the use of language evidence in court we will learn important concepts like forensic linguistics areas and scope of forensic linguistics the third one is forensic linguistics and criminal investigation or the criminal laws let's dive to the lecture and start from our first slide What is forensic linguistics? Linguistics is the application of linguistics method and theories to legal issues and problems. It involves the use of linguistic evidence in legal investigation, court proceeding and other legal context. Forensic linguistics is the application of linguistic knowledge and methods to legal issues, legal system. The multidisciplinary field draws on linguistic psychology, sociology and law. Forensic linguists are expert in the field of forensic and linguistics. Forensic linguists use language analysis to help solve legal disputes and crime. They may analyze written or spoken language such as suspect's statement, a ransom note, or a disputed contract. They also analyze language patterns and usage in order to identify the author of a document or to detect deception. They provide expert testimony in court and may work with law enforcement agencies, lawyers, police, and other legal professionals. tells important areas where forensic linguistics may or linguist may specialized first one is the deception detection forensic linguist may use language analysis to detect deception statement or written documents second one is language identification forensic linguist may analyze language patterns to identify the language or dialect used in a document or speech third one is medical legal forensic linguist may analyze language used in medical reports or records help with legal dis- disputes to medical practice or personal injury cases third one is discourse and textual analysis forensic linguist may analyze the language used in a to- text or conversation to help in understanding the meaning and context of language second last is terminology and fra- phrases forensic linguist may analyze specialized language used in particular field or industries as documents are technical manuals speech and audio analysis forensic linguist may analyze speech patterns and audio recording to identify speakers to help authentic recordings and last one is dialect analysis in dialect analysis forensic linguist may analyze the use of dialects in speech or writing to help identifying a speaker or a writer's origin or social authorship attribution a forensic linguist use computational and forensic knowledge to deal with the identification of the author of a piece of writing towards the use of linguistic features such as style vocabulary and grammar as well as syntax to determine the author's identity method can be used to identify the authors of letters email social media posts and other forms of writing and communication it is commonly used in cyber forensic linguist to analyze digital evidence like emails social media posts for forensic purposes additionally authorship attribution can also be used to detect plagiarism in academic work and other form of written content discourse analysis in forensic linguistics is a method used in f- forensic linguistics to analyze language in legal context so used to study the language and structure of legal documents contracts statement and police report in order to understand the meaning and intent or intention behind the language used It also be used to identify patterns biases in language used by different groups or individuals course analysis can be used to identify linguistic markers that may indicate deception or dishonesty in statement or police report it can also be used to identify patterns of language used legal that may reveal a bias or prejudice in the legal system discourse analysis and 
Language analysis are two important techniques or methods used to analyze the language and the structure of legal documents such as witness statement in order to identify inconsistencies or biases that may indicate deception. This can be used in criminal investigation to help determine the credibility of a witness or a suspect's testimony. Similarly, language analysis in criminal investigation is a method used to analyze spoken language such as in police interview to identify inconsistency or false statement that may indicate deception. This can be used in criminal investigation to help in determining the credibility of a suspect's sus statement and to identify key information that may be relevant to a case. Discourse analysis and language analysis are used to analyze language in order to identify patterns or similarities or inconsistencies that may indicate deception or dishonesty. This can be used to support or predict other forms of evidence in criminal investigation. Next application of forensic linguistics for criminal investigation is forensic phonetics. That is the branch of forensic linguistics that deals with the analysis of speech sounds in order to identify the speaker for voice recording or other spoken language. It can include analyzing the speaker's accent, dialect, voice characteristics, determine their identity, which can lead to the identification of a suspect. It can be used in criminal investigation, especially when the recording of voice is only evidence that is available for investigating the case. Next one is language and deception. That is another important area of forensic linguistics. It deals with the analysis of linguistic features of speech and text in order to detect deception. This can include analyzing the suspects or witness or victim's language, or inconsistencies, contradiction, other signs of deception. It can also indicate analyzing the use of language to detect patterns of deception like the use of hedging, evasion or other forms of linguistic manipulation. Assist investigation by providing insight into the credibility of statement and help to identify key information. Let's summarize important points of this lecture. Forensic linguistics is the application of linguistic analysis to legal issues and criminal justice. Important areas of forensic linguistics include authorship identification, spoken discourse analysis, language interpretation, language and the law, discourse analysis, language analysis. So forensic linguistics is an important area. It can be helpful for criminal investigation and for legal or justice system. You can get complete transcript of this lecture in the form of blog by clicking the link given in the description section. Please like, share and subscribe Linguistics with Tia.